हेलो स्टूडेंट्स गुड मॉर्निंग लेट्स स्टार्ट टूडेज क्लास डे स्टूडेंट टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट आवर कोर्स फ्रॉम पी टी टू टू एनुअल एग्जाम सो टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट chapter 12 it is natural resources that is water the chapter name is natural resource resources water dear student we are living on which planet on the earth the planet on which we are living is earth and we have eight planets in our solar system but life is possible only on the earth why because of availability of water and air on the earth in the absence of both these two things air and water life is not possible so all living beings need water to live dear student i am talking about air and water two things on which our life is depend so both these things is provided by whom by you can say these both these two things are provided by god or nature so my dear student all the things that are gifted by that are provided by god or nature is called natural resources is called natural resources the things gifted by god all the things on the earth that is gifted by god is called natural resources and natural resources we have a lot of resources we are gifted by a lot of resources but here in this lesson we are going to discuss about our very precious natural resource that is water water is very precious resource for our life because our life is depend on water so in this lesson we will discuss about natural resources water uses of water what are the different different types of irrigation irrigation methods and so on many things are there that will be discussed discussed in <coughs> this lesson all living beings need water to live beta all the living beings need water to live plant need water for producing food plants need water for producing food yes student plants make their food in the presence of sunlight and water without water they cannot survive on the earth so water is home to many animals yes student many animals living in the water such types of animals are called aquatic animal okay beta aquatic animals such types of animals are called aquatic animals human beings require water for drinking bathing cooking washing and for agriculture purposes 
Dear student, in this line, it is discussed that what are the uses of water in our daily life. In our daily life, how we use the water. So, human beings require water for drinking. We drink the water to quench our thirst. Next is bathing. Matlab nahana, cooking, khana banana, washing, kapde dhona ya koi kisi bhi cheez ko dhulna. And for most important purpose is agricultural purposes. Beta, we get food grains from where? From agricultural field. And agriculture is based on water. Without water, plant cannot survive. Crop cannot survive. There can be no life without water. We still face shortage of water. Still we are facing shortage of water. The reasons are as follows. Why we are facing the problem of or you can say the problem of shortage of water when we know on the earth in three-fourth portion is filled with water. Our earth is filled with three parts of the earth is covered by water and only one part, one fourth part is land area. So having large quantity of water, we are facing the problem of water scarcity. You can say water shortage of water. Why? Some reasons are there by which we are facing the problem of shortage of water. Pita, less than 3% of available water on the earth is fit for consumption. How much percent, Pita? How many percent? 3%. Only 3% water that is available on the earth is able for using. In our daily life, consumption मतलब होता है बेटा use. All the things which we are using is called consumption. उपयोग करना, उपभोग करना. The water in the seas and oceans is salty. Another reason is the water which is in the sea, seas and oceans. are filled with salty water so salty water is useless for us because we cannot drink the salty water this water is neither fit for drinking nor fit for used by farmers for watering their crops neither fit for drinking nor fit for fit to be used by farmers for watering their crop. Restaurant salty water, we cannot use the salty water in our daily life and farmer also cannot use the salty water in their agricultural activities. So, large portion of water is useless for us. Next is beta. Rain is the main source of fresh water. If anybody asks to you, what is the main source of fresh water? Your answer will be, rain is the main source of the fresh water. However, the rainy seasons last from for two or three months only. Beta, we enjoy rainy season only for two or three months. So it is very short period of time and after that 
After all, during the hot summer month, many rivers dry, people waste many rivers dry when in summer season. Summer in summer season, many rivers dry. And next is people waste water. We the we should not waste the water. People waste water means it is also the reason of shortage of water because limited water is available in limited amount and we cannot waste the water. We cannot waste the water because it is in limited amount. Water get polluted due to various human activities. Dear student, a lot of by a lot of our activities, water gets polluted. So, water get polluted due to various human activities. Polluted water is unfit for consumption. Dear student, this polluted water is not fit for unfit for the consumption. So, these are the reasons by which we are facing the problem of shortage of water. So, it's all about our today's class and in our next class, we will discuss about the remaining part of this lesson. My dear student, one thing that I want to remind you that do comment in comment box. It is very necessary, it is very important because we are maintaining your attendance month by month. So keep in mind and write your name, class and section in the comment box and keep it up. Thank you very much.